So today, I guess I've got a couple of terms for you. And the reason why it's a couple is because doing one without the other kind of is difficult, but you'll understand more when you understand the terms that I'm talking about. So the first term is agonist. And this is one you probably won't hear that much unless you're going to school and studying physiology. You may get it from context if I tell you what the antonym is. And the antonym is antagonist. So just like every good story, you know, there's a protagonist and an antagonist. And in the case of your muscles, antagonist just means directly opposing. So the agonist muscle is the primary mover. And because muscles don't singularly work inside a vacuum, when you have one contract, another is extending. Think of your bicep. When you do a bicep curl, you're contracting your bicep muscle, which is also the agonist. In concert with that, you are extending your tricep muscle, which is the antagonist of the bicep. They work in synchrony, in harmony. So when you think about it, every muscle contraction that you're normally going to work, especially if it's a lever, there is another muscle that is opposing it. When you do push-ups or bench press or something, you're not just working your chest, you are also working your back because your back is controlling part of the motion while the chest is controlling the other half. This is why I wanted to do both of the terms in concert, agonist and antagonist. Just remember, one is the primary and the other is the opposing, which is the secondary muscle that is acting on it. Now, when you work one, you are focusing on the agonist. You are also working the antagonist just a little bit because of the motion. Remember, just like any good story, there's a protagonist and an antagonist, and this holds true when you do muscles. So remember, like always, create the type of community you wanna live in. Hey, if you made it this far, can you leave me a green heart in the comments? It really helps me to understand when people are watching the video all the way through because analytics aren't always great on these platforms. Anyways, I'll catch you later. Peace.